Now to a developing story out of the North Towns tonight. We've been following this for you on 7 Eyewitness News. We first told you last week about changes to Williamsville's old home days designed to keep away crowds of teens who were hanging out, not spending money, and sometimes causing trouble. But are those changes making a difference? 7 Eyewitness News reporter Katie Moore stopped by the event to find out. We had a bad start yesterday with the weather, but today's been great. We had a record number of sales for the rides. Old Home Days organizers happy with the way this year's event is going so far. In the past, families complained and even left because groups of teens were standing around, some underage drinking. This year, new rules seem to be changing that. A lot of families coming in and they're not coming back out like I was telling you about, so it's a great sign. Signs like this one tell families teens aren't allowed in without an adult after six and they can't bring in backpacks. Julie Lawrence and her sister come every year and this year they brought their young nephew. They think the changes have helped. I remember last year coming with the kids and having like a double stroller and having such a hard time getting through the kids. The crowds of kids that all walked together and there would be kids all around and you saw them drinking and doing things they shouldn't be doing. Even teens say they understand the new rules. I think some of them are good to keep kids like in check and everything. Some kids who are um, like disrespectful or like not behaving well, it's good for them. Organizers say the goal is to make sure Old Home Days stays a family-friendly event, one that makes money at the same time. The money we raise here all goes back to the community, it goes to the youth of Amherst. Over the years, we've given over $700,000 back to the community, so we're pretty proud of that. Now, there were also a number of Amherst police and security officers walking around Island Park, but the people I spoke with today said Friday and Saturday night will probably be when these new rules are tested the most. Old Home Days runs through Saturday. We've got a link with all that information on our website, wkbw.com. Katie Morse, 7 Eyewitness News.